Hi friends, hi this is Subramani. Welcome back to my channel. First of all, I want to say thank you for selecting my video on YouTube. In this video, I am going to explain how to make GST bills in Excel. That is in GST invoice, how to create a GST invoice in Excel. That is here, you have to fill your company name and fill your company address and fill your GST number. And here you need to enter your invoice number and here the date. Okay. Then here enter your company supplier that is uh, sorry customer name, customer name and address and his and the GST number. Okay. You just leave this blank. Okay. Now here the serial number how it will works you know just here i am giving this uh, drop down list items just you have to select once you select the items see automatically the hsn code and uh, units automatically it will come okay only the quantity you have to fill that's it g say i then a item a a then b then here uh, i want to enter one more uh, k like this okay say 6 this you know cages and price automatically will pick up from this sheet uh, that is uh, products you know this is item hsn code units rate and uh, gst rate also will pick up from here once you fill all this just uh, you click this add to database see there is no data as of now okay once i click add to data that will save in this the data sheet i am clicking the add to database see invoice saved successfully you see here all items and hsn uh, code everything came here how much is the amount 62,925 we'll check it 62,928 correct 62,925 62,925 okay this is the way you have to fill this tool file I am giving giving away for just uh, 500 rupees if you need to this uh, tool just uh, call my number uh, 9543198132 in this number you need to contact okay now one more option is uh, preview print preview once you click this uh, invoice Say invoice number one double zero two. This is the preview. Why I put this preview means uh, if we have so many uh, invoices, uh, previous invoices, it's a track for uh, getting invoice. Uh, back so this is the way you have to enter i will put one more invoice say 1003 date on 31st august 2025 okay now here i am going to enter only two items just to delete these items 
but you should, you should not take this uh, what do you call uh, here i used this uh, functions like this if error we look okay this is also so that don't delete this then here also delete here i am deleting this okay 1003 invoice i have entered only two items add to database 1003 data say one double zero three invoice number only two items okay this is the way you have to change and also for this uh, party name and address also we can put uh, drop down list that is not a issue you can contact uh, this mobile number so that uh, i can generate uh, software for your uh, billing requirements thank you for watching this video bye bye